Doug Wolfgang is one of the most successful sprint car drivers of all times, and one of his most stirring victories took place at Syracuse in the Sprint Car Nationals back in 1989, the subject of this week's Hall of Fame flashback. This week in our Hall of Fame flashback, we go back to the 1989 Round Round Nationals for the World of Outlaws at the Moody Mile during Super Dirt Week. Ironically, this was the year that the USA organization, a rival sprint car sanctioning body, was in operation. That meant that Steve Kinzer and Sammy Swindell would not compete at the Moody Mile. Nevertheless, it was a fantastic race with a controversial finish. Here's the battle that raged all race long. Doug Wolfgang on the inside in car number eight. Dave Blaney on the outside in car number seven, battling for the lead down the back straightaway. Here's the controversial part. Blaney on the outside tries to make the pass for the lead. The caution flag comes out. It looks like Blaney is in front of the Wolf. But the World of Outlaw officials reverse it and put Wolfgang up in front. Wolfgang would lead the remainder of the distance and go on to win the 1989 Ground Round Nationals at Super Dirt Week. It was one of the biggest wins of Wolfgang's career. Doug Wolfgang, a true champion. Hopefully, he'll be back soon. Ah, Doug Wolfgang in victory lane. Larry, do you think we'll ever see that again? Andy, I think you can make book on it. I really do. I believe that before April 1 of 1993, that victory lane site, Doug Wolfgang. I wouldn't want to bet against it. The spotlight falls on the modifieds right after some weekend winners. Stick around.